I do remember once, because you find also, there are a lot of traces of colonialism and, and everywhere here, especially in this quarter where we are sitting here now, in African quarters, names which are glorified, the colonial criminals, telling us these are the pioneers, the founder of the colonies, and that's why they are glorifying them here. That is not really a respect to us. That's not respect to us, we Africans. And sometimes they ask, is that, it is that not racism? What is all that? Is it not racism still up to them? Those streets here which we are demanding will be renamed. Anyway, still it will take time. So you find they say, you people, what you are doing is not right because you want to rub off the history, which is not true. What is just only those streets which are glorifying these this colonial criminals and we have the alternative names those ones who fought against colonialism. So you find we are pulling back this history, which it is there, but totally covered up. No one knows, especially the young generations, even it's not been taught in the school. But they have been taught a little bit about about the British colonialism, French colonialism, Portuguese colonialism, or Spanish colonialism, and so on. But German colonialism, it wasn't there. It wasn't there. So if I rename the street, we are really putting this history again alive, but in a critical way, which is okay that way. It's okay that way. But you find it really nowadays, especially now, for instance, in Neupol, there is a street, Wisman Street, which we started in 2005 when we Tanzanian community to the uh, commemoration match that one there it was in 2005 and we started there in this manistrasse they started their culture <laughs> so <laughs> you find at the same day because this this man he was really a brutal german general and, and is the one who who formed the so-called Schutztruppe in Germany, East Africa. And you find this, they were mercenaries. These were soldiers from Sudan, from the Shangani people of Mozambique and from the Zulu people of South Africa. And it was really a brutal one, known and feared one. And you find such people, they glorify them. Even that one, I was talking to him when I was sitting there, you find in that um, cultural object which is on there, it is from Congo, the Bisman who brought it, because he met twice, he was financed by King of Belgium, Leopold's, to go through Central Africa from West to East two times, and on the way, he was taking whatsoever he found so nice, like the objects, and, and even that one is a very cultural one. It's a very ritual one to the Congolese people. So nowadays you find, I, we did a try, and then we said, yeah, no hope. But four years back, three years back, again, we did a kind of uh, symbol, renaming and and and, and we 
they, we did it a comedy, three ladies, two of them from Tanzania. The first one is Mkomanile, who was a chief too during the Majimaji war and he went to war against the Germans and he was hanged with the other 67. So we did recommend her as an alternative name for this man. And another lady from Tanzania, Tulu Slamek, who was the first minister as a woman at that time when we got independence, the first also during the first when as when we got our independence. And she was also famous, especially when she had her speech in America and said that Africans are not poor. Very proud and, and, and so. And she formed a real, the Women Union of Tanzania and so on. So we did also recommend her. And then the Afro-German lady, Fasia Hansen, who was born here during the National Socialism. And she had a very tough time during the Nazi time and so on. A lot of problems and, and, and. so, and she was a good musician and, and she did a lot against National Socialism. So these three names were taken by them and the people had to recommend them and you find people who are living in that area. So over 77 recommended the lady who fought against the German in Kumanile, and then the second 54, the lady who then was the first minister and so on, and then Francia Janssen came third. So it seems the way now things are going on, the way they are developing, they are going now, the name now will be they are going to decide which name on the 25th of November, but it looks she has already been taken. So, but it's to put, always try to talk to these people, try to demand really seriously and anyway to have patience because now it's already over 15 years but still I was around running after it as if I, as a mad person but it does work and what we need is then to be conscious about these things and work on it and not just only in a loose way and uh, Keep on it, and then at the end we can harvest something. If not, that really we are intending, but still, still it brings things a change.